What's up you guys, it's your boy Floyd here. Um, today's video is gonna be five amazing tips that I'm gonna give you my niggas, my pretty boys, on how to grow your hair fast and healthy. So, let's get into that right now. No bullshitting, here we go. So, the first tip is to deep condition your hair weekly. Now, I personally do it every Wednesday. You guys can do it um, any other day. It really doesn't matter. Um, I, I really don't care. No, I'm just playing out. I, I do. I care about my pretty boys. But no homo. Um, so all that gay shit aside, what? So this is a little bit wet, but we're gonna see, I can see that. That is the Shea Moisture Super Fruit Complex 10 in 1 Renewal System with Mahola Marula, Marula Oil and Biotin. Now, biotin is um, also a special ingredient that I will get to you guys later about, later in this video. And it also is H Defier Color Protect. If you guys get, I'm not gonna read everything that it does. It's a, it's a fucking 10 in one, so it does a lot of shit. So, yep, that is tip number one. Get yourself a hair mask or a deep conditioner. You can use this as a deep conditioning thing. That's why I have it. So, um, Basically, when you deep condition, all you do is uh, you wet your hair, put it in there, leave it in there for about 30 minutes. Um, I'm really ghetto right now, and I'm living in a dorm, so I can't be bougie how I used to be and put on a shower cap, so I have to use a plastic bag. So with that plastic bag, you just uh, wrap around your hair and leave it on there for about an hour. Take it out, wash it out, you're good to go. You know, style like I usually do. Tip number three, if you guys have dead ends, I these are an example of dead ends. Um, I just choose to keep them because it is really hard to find a barber down here. You do have to cut off the dead ends and meet, see, annoying shit like that. That's an example of a dead end or a split end. It's just really straight and that's from heat damage. And yeah, so it's really difficult for me down here to find a barber. Um, all there is is just hair cutteries and uh, sport clips. And uh, I don't want them to fuck my shit up, so I'm not gonna go to them. Uh, if you guys do have the luxury of having a barber shop, just cut off the dead ends. Just, you know, trim it. Um, you know, trim it till the dead ends are gone, you know? and you should be good after that. So number three is gonna tie back into number two. After you cut off all the dead ends and the chemically damaged hair and all that shit, do not cut your hair anymore, just let it grow. You know, um, I'm sure you don't wanna go around with a, uh, a weird ass looking uh, hairline, so just get a line up every single time that you go to the barber shop if you're just trying to grow out your hair. Um, if you're just trying to grow out the top, just fade the sides like I do. You know, get all around taper fade or a high temp fade, whatever you guys want to call it. Just get that. And uh, yeah, so that's tip number. At this moment, your boy knew he fucked up. Wait, what the f? Did I skip number two? Or did I say number three? Oh, damn. I said number three for number two. This is number three. Yo, I'm messing up. So that was tip number three. The last what? one was number two. Nigga, what? What are you talking about? Yeah. I'm over here editing this shit. Okay, so number four. If you guys want that healthy hair, I recommend that you take multivitamins. Now, if your diet really consists of, you know, um, overly processed food, um, if you guys diet is basically if your diet is pretty shitty um, Just in, invest I was gonna say in zest invest in some multivitamins Then I've heard this before like since I was a little kid is to take fish oil pills daily um, and That just makes your hair more shinier and healthy another vitamin which I can say that I have took in is biotin Biotin. So, biotin is a supplement that promotes hair, uh, nail growth, hair and nail growth, and uh, healthy-looking 
you cool looking skin. You know what? Um, all of these vitamins that I'm listing, you better get the gummy ones because, uh, do they have fish oil gummies? I rec yeah, just get the gummy jumps because they're fun to chew and not, you know, you just don't swallow them. Another thing, um, tip number, wait, oh, wow, four was pretty long. Tip number five, it's the last one. That's a thumbnail. Light skin face. All right, so tip number five is uh, if you are, basically, if you're black, you generally will have a dry hair. Now, if you've ever heard anybody tell you, you know, you need to wash your hair every day, uh, you're gonna fuck your shit up. Yeah, but it's not disgusting or uh, dirty if you don't shampoo your hair at all. Um, I used to just condition it until I got this blonde hair right here. Um, after the blonde hair, I just started using toner shampoo, which is Shimmer Lights toner shampoo, which I will put in another video on how to take care of this blonde hair. If you are going to shampoo your hair, I recommend that you get a sulfate-free shampoo or a shampoo with Moroccan oil. I don't know why, but this year in 2015, yes, yeah, still 2015, and this year in 2015, Moroccan oil is somehow the hair elixir of our age. Um, I don't know, this shit just popped up out of nowhere. If you don't know, uh, you know, just Google Argan Moroccan oil and you'll find it and you'll probably see a whole bunch of fucking benefits for it. Basically, sulfate is a very uh, abrasive uh, cleaning agent that is in most shampoos. Basically, strips your hair of a lot more, more oil than what should be stripped of. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's, yeah. Ah, this is awkward. This is the end. This is the end of the video. I'll see y'all next week.